大家好，欢迎收听今天的早安英文，我是卡拉。And this is Dylan. Hello, welcome to Morning English. 早安英文呢是一个为大家免费提供英语教学的频道，每天都会更新。如果你想获得关于英语听说读写的内容，我们都会在这个频道更新。我们的目标是帮助全球的华人学好英语。如果你觉得还不错的话，记得给我们订阅哦。另外，点开小铃铛，这样的话就不会错过其他任何学习视频啦。对了，如果你想获取本节课的完整版笔记，在视频简介或者评论区领取哦。你也可以给这个视频点赞，点赞就相当于自动保存啦。So Dylan, I think you'll be pleasantly surprised about today's topic. Oh yeah? What is it? Guess. Cars. Nope. Uh, food. Nope. History. Well, yes, kinda. History idioms. Ah,、oh. well, this is this is going to be exciting. Yeah. And really, food? <laughs> yeah, I like food and cars. <laughs> 好的，好的。那我们今天呢，给大家聊一聊 history idioms， 就是和历史有关的一些俗语和习语。So when talking about an important event that is currently happening or has recently finished, you can say that or this will go down in the history books. 嗯，首先呢，要给大家分享的第一个历史习语就是 that 或者 this will go down in The history books. Yeah, <laughs> so you can imagine if you're watching a sporting event like soccer or、mm. football or something, and one of the players does something amazing. Amazing, the guy who's who's narrating the the game will often say, "This will this is one for the history books, folks. This will go down in history as the best goal or or unit ever scored or whatever." Okay. 所以呢，就是如果说发生什么重大事情，或者说非常精彩的事情的时候，你就可以讲这句话。它的中文翻译呢，就是说这将被载载入史册。Um, so, uh, if something is not important or irrelevant, you can say that is ancient history. 因为 ancient 是古代的意思。对呀、啊。啊，就是这个是。对，这就是古老的历史了。所以呢，这句话的意思啊 ，that is a。Oh my God! Ancient, ancient, ancient history. It means that this is old history. It is old history. It is old history. It is old history. If you're watching something、uh, very important unfold in front of you, you can say history in the making. This is very similar to the first one,、uh, uh, one for the history books. Um, it means that history is being created. It is very important. Very important. Amazing 的事情正在发生。Yeah, so this would this could be used to describe like an important event, like when a man walked on the moon. You could say history in the making. 啊、uh, ，就是非常有历史意义的这种大事件的时候，比如说人类登上月球啦，你就可以讲 history is in the making. Yeah, remember if you use ing, it's current progressive tense. So it has to be happening now into the future. 是不是可以有这个 is 也可以没有这个 is history in the making? In the making in, is in the making 都可以都可以 yeah. 嗯，好嘞。下一个。Uh, if you want to express that someone is telling you a lie, you can say they are rewriting the history books. 嗯，这个 writing 我们知道是写的意思。那么 rewriting re 是一个前缀，表示再一次又一次。所以呢，就是重新书写这个历史书。那么就是说，他们正在篡改历史。当你知道某人正在说谎的时候呢，你就可以讲这一句话。So let's go over some of that vocabulary. 嗯 ，will go down in the history books. Something will go down， 是吧 ？Yeah. 啊、呃，就是说这件事情将会被载入史册。That is ancient history. 就说这是陈年老账了，这是旧闻了，家喻户晓的事情了。Uh, and this is usually used、um, when talking about something negative, like if you and somebody else had a fight a long, long time ago, and you don't even remember what it's about. 嗯，就说这个事件呢，通常都是很久之前发生的，且呢是一个呃不是太好的事情，不会用来形容很、yeah. 很积极的事情。History in the making. 历史正在被创造。Rewriting the history books. They are rewriting history. So in English, we often say history repeats itself. This means that certain events and/or ideas have been done in the past, and that we need to study history to learn what will happen in the future. 嗯，这句话的意思呢，再给大家重复一遍啊，叫做 history repeats itself， 就是说历史呢往往会重演。You can also say I am history to tell people goodbye. 就是在说再见的时候讲 I'm history. Yeah, 我已经成为历史了，所以就再见了吧。Remember, we did a a a podcast about saying goodbye in English, and there's like 
two hundred ways to say it. 嗯，对， yeah. 就是我们之前做过一期节目啊，就是说，呃，说再见有两百多种方式，当然有点夸张吧。嗯、mm-hmm. 呃，但是这里呢，就是又属于另外一种方式啊，你可以讲 I am history， 我已经成为历史了，所以就再见了吧，再见了您嘞。If you want to express how important something is before you do it, you can say, "Let's make history." Or make history. Let us make some history. That is, make some history. That is, make some history. To express that that everyone else knows how a story will end, you can say, "And the rest is history."、Mm. Yeah. So, as an example, I would say,、um, "The Mongols came down from Mongolia and conquered the Song Dynasty, and the rest is history." 嗯，所以呢，它其实就是讲 the rest part， yeah，、uh, the rest of the story， exactly， 就是剩下的那一趴呢，其他的呢，大家都知道了。所以就是当你比如说讲述一个事情的时候啊，你讲讲完前面的趴，然后呢加一句 the rest is history，、yeah. 就是说那剩下的呢，我就呃不费不费口舌去讲了，因为大家都知道了。This is also used to express or to emphasize the beginning of a story. Does that make sense? To emphasize the importance of the beginning of the story. Ah,、uh, so you, if you use this sentence to say, is to take the rest of the part away. You also emphasize the beginning of the part away. Okay, let's go over some more, more vocabulary. Um,、mm. history repeats itself. History often repeats itself. History 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 repeats itself. Oh yeah. yeah, what's that again? What's that sentence again? History doesn't repeat itself, but it rhymes. Uh, history doesn't repeat itself, but it rhymes. Yeah. Ah,、uh, 行，非常的严谨啊。那句话的意思呢，就是说历史它不会完完全全一模一样的重演，但是呢，会有类似的部分。I am history. 我已经成为历史了。再见吧。To make history. 创造历史，或者说做出一些值得载入史册的一些重要的事情。The rest is history. 其他的都众所周知了，剩下来的事情部分大家都知道了。So you can tell that、uh, with history idioms, they often have、uh, a significant、uh, importance attached to them. Okay.、Mm. They usually have some kind of profound meaning. 所以呢，就是基本上和这些 history 有关的。短语啊，都是一些比较说，呃，和重要的事情啊，或者说意义深远的事情啊，扯上关系。所以大家如果以后再看到其他呢，可以往这个方向去推测一下。And this is why history is so important to study. Like the Big Bang Theory song says, <laughs> "Math, science, history, discovering the mystery. It all started with the Big Bang." Oh, okay,、mm. okay. Yep. So study your history, kids. Yeah, but he's a terrible singer. Hello, welcome to Morning English. 早安英文呢是一个为大家免费提供英语教学的频道，每天都会更新。如果你想获得关于英语听说读写的内容，我们都会在这个频道更新。我们的目标是帮助全球的华人学好英语。如果你觉得还不错的话，记得给我们订阅哦。另外，点开小铃铛，这样的话就不会错过其他任何学习视频啦。对了，如果你想获取本节课的完整版笔记，在视频简介或者评论区领取哦。你也可以给这个视频点赞，点赞就相当。I am a perfect singer, <laughs> guys. I want you to write in and tell me I am a perfect singer. Do it and do it now. <laughs> 好了，我们今天这期节目就到这里了吧。我是卡拉 ，and this is Dylan. 我们下期见。Bye bye. bye.